Hi friends. In this video, we will understand the integration of Weybridge system with Satatya Samas. Basic requirements. Existing Weybridge system. Satatya Samas V2 R4. Satatya Samas LPR add-on license. Weybridge system consists of first weighing platform in a company which is used to measure the weight of the vehicle parked on it second ip cameras in the front back top or side of the vehicle to capture the license plate clearly third boom barriers at entry and exit of the platform and fourth signal lights to indicate halts and movements of the vehicle optional when the vehicle comes on the weighing bridge the weight is displayed on the led screen in front of a security guard a file is generated by the software containing information about the vehicle like unique id license plate number images of the vehicle etc let us start with the configuration. We will complete the configuration in 5 steps. First, configure IVA event. Second, create file template for export. Third, define backup drive. Fourth, configure event and action. And fifth, generate reports. Let us start with the first step. Go to IVA server and select the server. Add the desired camera or cameras. Select license plate recognition event. Switch the status on. Detect on event flag enables the IVA server to start detecting license plate once it receives a trigger from an event. Detect on schedule flag enables the IVA server to start detecting license plate on specified schedule. Select the country. Add the zones. Set the confidence percentage. Confidence percentage is percentage of accuracy that the system will consider while detecting the license plate. Higher confidence percentage will give precise license plate number. Redetect time is the time after which the system will detect the license plate again. Enter this field in seconds. Check user identification flag. Enabling user identification flag will identify the user from user database of Samas. Check user authorization flag. Enabling user authorization flag asks the user to approve or reject the license plate detected. Click apply to save the configuration. This completes the first step. Let us move on to the second step of creating a template of the file to be exported. Go to General Settings module followed by Templates.
under file export option click add enter the desired name of the template Check export with field label flag to include entries with labels in the file. Select the file criteria. Create with timestamp option will generate the file with date and time in it. Overwrite existing file will overwrite the entries in the same file. Create and update in existing file will update the same file retaining the previous entries. Select the file format. Select the field separator. Enter the name of the export field. Select the event type. Selecting event will generate the values on occurrence of an event. Selecting static will generate a fixed value for all the entries. Select the event. For instance, if the event is selected as LPR user authorized, the entry in the file will be generated every time when a user authorizes the license plate. Select the event parameter. For instance, for the event selected as LPR user authorized, the event parameter should be selected as LPR number. Make sure to map a field which differentiates the entries distinctly. Click Apply to save the configuration. This completes the second step. Let us start with the third step of defining the backup drive. Go to Servers and Devices module followed by Recording Server. Under Storage option, click Add Backup Drive followed by Local Drive. Enter the name of the drive. Select the storage level. Primary backup is the first level of backup for recorded files of cameras. Archive 1 is the second level of backup for recorded files wherein the audio gets removed. Archive 2 is the third level of backup for recorded files wherein the frames get dropped. Storage type and storage path will be automatically fetched by the system. Drive capacity and free space can be seen below. Click OK to add the drive. This completes the third step. Let us start with the fourth step of adding action for the event. Go to Event and Action module.
select the desired camera. For the event LPR authorized, select the action generate file. Select the schedule. Select the export template created in step 2. Enter the file name. Select the backup drive and click OK. The event and action will be mapped. This completes the fourth step. Whenever a vehicle comes over a weighing bridge, the security personnel triggers the IVA server, enabling it to start detecting license plate of the vehicle with the help of cameras connected in its proximity. Satatya Samas then exports the file to the third-party Waybridge system software which enters other required fields like weight of the vehicle, carriage type, etc. into the file. This updated file is then imported into Satatya Samas and report containing comprehensive information is displayed. Let us start with the fifth step of generating reports. Go to System Monitor, Module, followed by Event Reports. Select Evidence Reports option and select the duration. Enable the Imported Fields flag. This will include all the fields from third-party software. Enable the Event Fields flag. This will include all the fields related to the events in Samas. Select the event. Select the fields to display for this event. Enable Include Images flag to include images of license plate captured. Select the camera or cameras. Set the file format. Set the download path. If you want to filter the data by any field, go to Add Filter. Add any additional information about the report in Add Description and click Generate Report. The report will be displayed. This completes the last step. Thank you for watching this video. For further queries, please contact Matrix Technical Support Team.